So I bought my first film camera and I'm so excited about it. <laughs> I'm Connie and this is my YouTube channel and uh, I decided to start this as an experiment to register my first steps, my first baby steps in film photography. I got my first middle format camera. This is a Mamiya C330 and I'm so happy and excited about it. Um, I wasn't sure if I wanted to get a 35 millimeters or a middle format camera, but um, to be honest, I wasn't sure if I was going to be able to afford a second camera at least in a long time so I decided to go straight into middle format why not right but anyway I want to show you my first ever cam film camera this is an Olympus Trip MT3 and this is actually like my first experience with film uh, my mother got it for me when I was probably like 8 or 12 years old uh, I use this only for fun. I never never use it like professionally or seriously. I want to start like to experiment properly and to learn and to yeah see the world with different eyes in a different format. It's square format which is also new for me. So let's see. Let's see how this goes. This time I want to show you my first three rolls of film and all of them were like different experiences. The first two are Portra 400 and for these two rolls I took my time. I think each of them took me one month <laughs> to shoot. Uh, I was so self-conscious and self-aware about what I was doing that I was thinking too much, you know? I, I felt like there was never like a moment good enough to shoot. I don't know, I think I was just scared. I was just scared of the camera, I was scared about the fact that it was filmed, it felt like too serious, it felt, um, yeah, it felt too much. And also, it's interesting that as this camera is so big and draws so much attention, it was very, very difficult for me to go outside by myself because I am a very shy person and it's difficult to me when a stranger approaches to have this camera on my own at first felt quite intimidating but when I started to go out by myself I started to enjoy the process more and also nobody ever looked at me or talked to me yeah it's just like I'm not that important <laughs> so this first rolls of film I learned a little bit but uh, it took me a while to develop them so to be honest I didn't remember exactly well what happened in each picture. I had an idea, but as it took me too much to take the pictures and also another while to go to a lab and to have them developed. Yeah, it was a good exercise, but not good enough for me to remember what I was exactly doing. I think that the only proper thing that I could get was that as you know this is a TLR or maybe you don't know but this is a TLR so I don't see exactly the picture I'm going to get I have a little, di a little difference between the thing I see on the screen versus the actual picture this is why it has like two lenses even though I have this line that shows me where I'm cutting the picture it's not very precise. I, for example, in this picture, I was supposed to be like taking the whole cathedral, but no, I wasn't. <laughs> anyway, I, I'm not frustrated at all about it. It's, I'm just very open that this is an experiment, and I'm not like even sad that the pictures are not good. I'm actually like very excited about the pictures. <laughs> I'm like terribly happy about this. Um, even if they're not good, it's just like, I don't know, it's exciting. I think you get me. Yeah, the second roll which was more or less similar, but in this case, I got the focus bad in a couple of uh, cases. And also, I don't know if I saved badly the film, I mean, when I, when I took it off the camera. I don't know if I exposed it to light, I don't remember. 
but I got these uh, problems with this a uh, couple of pictures and also I forgot to measure light properly I'm just using my phone to measure I don't have a proper light meter so I don't know if that's an actual problem or not but I don't remember if I forgot to measure or if it's actually my mobile phone that didn't got the exposure properly first steps you know <laughs> Well, and finally, I decided to kind of like oh, set myself a challenge. This was a bad idea. No, this wasn't a bad idea. It was interesting. I decided to shoot one roll in one day. It was a very hot Sunday in which I decided to go around the city. By the way, this is not my city anymore. I used to live there and this was like a sort of trip to say goodbye to the city but mainly to set myself this challenge of don't think too much you just should what you have in front of you and try to make a good picture no okay this was this was bad guys like really really bad <laughs> i just didn't like the pictures Maybe they are not like extremely bad, at least I expose correctly and the focus it's okay, which it's good for uh, my third role I would say, but uh, I think the content is just boring, you know, at least for me. Also the experience of shooting one role in one day was a factor of high anxiety for me, you know, I was thinking too much and yeah, it, I was too nervous and too anxious about it. I just like this picture, but I didn't expose it correctly, so... Um, well, whatever. It was an interesting experience though. Um, I like to expose myself to this kind of experiences so that I know what I have to improve. I just want to show you step by step um, how this process developed and I hope you enjoy it and I hope maybe you join me because I really really want to start setting myself some challenges and uh, see if they actually help or they just stress me too much like the last one and maybe I just need more time I don't know um, I'm discovering myself in this journey but also I want to like have full manage of the camera right now is is still not we're still not friends you know <laughs> i love her but i don't know her very much so we still don't have this like i'm taking this like very relaxedly i don't want to like set myself too high expectations but I want to try to push myself a little, that's why I also started the challenge because I need some pressure, you know, like public opinion is important for that. <laughs> well that's it, I hope you like it and this is my first uh, video, I hope it wasn't too long or too boring. I'm going to learn this like, of course it's fun because I'm learning film and I'm also learning about YouTube, so, so yeah, everything is new for me, yeah. <laughs>